G'day, and thanks for your time. Uh, look, everybody loves a jigsaw puzzle, and we thought that seeing as we've submitted the board game, Cruise the World game, we should complement it and give you an alternative choice in a couple of varieties of jigsaw puzzles. We've known from our cruises there's always a jigsaw puzzle in play on one of the large tables and contributed a few pieces myself, I guess. Um, so look, we've put together a couple of jigsaw puzzle ideas, and we'll show you the way we've evolved them. Initially, we looked at doing two. We looked at doing a junior one, which would have a scene of the boat, a scene of the playground, the pool or whatever, or a senior one, which would of course be more related to the cruise, probably a boat. Now we thought, okay, it's impractical, two puzzles, two production costs, additional storage. So we put those aside, put those aside, and we've come up with a souvenir edition twin jigsaw puzzle pack. So it's a smaller component. We've still got a couple of good sized jigsaw puzzles in there, a smaller one for the children and one for the adults, which will be a boat. Give you an indication of the content for the adult one, a 200 piece puzzle. Probably something like that. Sorry that I'm jumping around like a blue art here, but however, um, yeah, something like that, uh, good involvement, a good souvenir. But wait, there's more. We've decided to look at something that's a lot less expensive and packs into a smaller size. Bear with me again. Appropriately, this is called the wave puzzle. And very appropriate for a boat, obviously, because of the wave. We've called it the wave puzzle because of this. All those little white lines across there are where the cuts would be. Primarily, this thing just fits in like this. It's a nice, cheap version of a puzzle. It could be wrapped in a shrink wrap bag and even hung on a hook if you like. So relatively inexpensive to produce and uh, obviously an interesting thing and it can be as complex as we like by dividing these vertical cuts into horizontal pieces three or four so you could have a couple of hundred pieces on that if we so desired. Um, also we've got here what we call our puzzle or panel puzzle with these which pop out like that you know so again I think we think it's fairly new I don't think anyone's done something like that before another one there and also a bubble puzzle where the circular thing. So there's a lot of alternative if you're looking at puzzles for a carnival cruises. And also the opportunity is there to uh, present the ships of the line on the, on the reverse side of it. You can see, uh, you know, if it's a, a global thing, you could Caribbean cruise boats. If it's Australian, you can have the Australian cruise liners, etc., etc. So that's where we are with this thing. Uh, thank you if you've got as far as looking at this. I hope it's not too laborious for you. We'd just like to say uh, good luck. And if you'd like to proceed, well, I guess someone can let me know. E email me back, whatever. Or I shall call one way or the other. Thank you very, very much.